Oh, sorry, it's wobbly. <laughs> um, hi there. This is going to be a general love reading for the sign of Scorpio. Hi, Scorpios, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, as well as the cross watcher of the Scorpio. This is going to be kind of the usual, but I'm starting this new series where all of the extendeds for the 12 zodiac signs will be with the sexual tarot magic deck cards, okay? So it's basically like 12 zodiac signs will have their own intimate readings, okay? So if you guys feel that this resonates for you and you want to watch that extended, it will contain, of course, other tarot decks and oracle decks, but it will be the sexual tarot magic deck cards, okay? So let us just see what the energy is like. This is going to be, as you may have guessed, primarily focused on love, emotions, and intimacy, okay? So I'm still trying to feel out what I wanna name this new series. Huh. Calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. Can I just tell you that when I saw the word visualizations and I said it, I knew exactly what it meant. It meant fantasizing. You or this other person is fantasizing. Visualizing the other person, visualizing the way they look, imagining the way they smell, imagining the way that they taste. I just heard so good, I can hardly wait. Well, honey, neither can we, okay? We can't wait at all. Let's just get right into this shit. So good, I can hardly wait. Okay, all right. What's this? Oh, the Ace of Pentacles. Someone wants to give you something really big. The Ace of Pentacles for me is usually moving or career change, right? But it also can symbolize a solid offer of commitment. They wanna put a ring on it. Oh, oh my God, that's what this is. They wanna put a ring on it. If you like it, then you better put a ring on it. If you like it, then you better put a ring on it. Look, Page of Pentacles, they're really nervous too. It could be a younger earth sign. But you see how they're just kind of standing there with the pentacle kind of like... So this may have been something where it was a minute that this person has sort of been debating about offering something. This could have been... And it doesn't have to be that it's actual engagement, okay? It could be something that leads to actual engagement, right? But this is definitely something here where you're just like, oh... They've been wanting to offer something before they actually offer something for a minute. Does that make sense? Oh, it's going to be so fucking sudden too. Look at that, the tower. The tower is sudden, it's unexpected. The tower is also what you don't see coming. You don't see this coming. How come? Because... Maybe it's because this person has kept it to themselves, yeah, that they were into you, that they felt that they was feeling you. Maybe it's because universe said, nah, not time. I don't know. This is also could be a breakup or a shakeup. Ooh. Page of Cups, Two of Swords. Someone's blessings were right in front of them. See the Two of Swords, how she has blindfolds on? Someone's blessings was right in front of them. Maybe this person was right in front of you all along you didn't notice, or vice versa. Now, the Page of Cups could be friendship. Yes, honey. So I'm trying to get a good angle here because I didn't film in my bedroom for a minute, so I'm really trying to get the best angle without the most double chin and stomach protruding. So this is... This feels like for some of you it was friendship and then they didn't say they loved you. 
So it's, it's, it's when Harry met Sally. Which I've done a, a special love reading called that recently. Because I watched it on the plane recently. Remember I was telling you guys? And I was like, holy shit. So for some of you, it is that, right? It's the Dave from Accounting thing. How Dave from Accounting's been in love with you ever since, ever since. <clears throat> but he's either been too afraid to come forward or he has tried and you never noticed. Six of Swords. Something is coming forward. Something is making its way. It, there's movement here with that Six of Swords. Could also be travel. Could also be moving on to calmer waters. <clears throat> mm, the King of Cups told you. Someone's in love. Not only are they in love, but they have been holding back, wanting to ask you out, wanting to make it official, wanting to court you, wanting to... The, the desire that they have is so deep too. I mean, look at these two guys. <clears throat> the, the look on their face is so deep, the desire. It's just like... They want to eat ya. Five of Cups, Sadness. And then the page of, excuse me, the Hanged Man. Change of Perspective. See, someone has a change of perspective here. There's some kind of realizing what's right in front of me. See how the Five of Cups is perspective. They're so busy worrying about what they lost, they don't even see this two cups right here. That's I, I told you, it's about change of perspective. Somebody may not have seen something that was literally right in front of them. Was it you? Was it them? All I know is one person may not have been aware of it while the other person has been fantasizing and yearning and pining and imagining to a whole lot of fucking things honey and this is why in the extended we are going to use the sexual tarot magic deck cards honey we don't do them here on youtube because you know these karens love to report everything so to purchase this click on the link below okay it would be in the we're going to call these the Zodiac Intimate Extended or something of that sort. You guys will know it, okay? Match up the title of this with the title of that. It's new. That's why I haven't actually come up with what I want to call these. So because you guys are my first ones. Mm -hmm. Scorpios, you see? You're the first ones I'm doing. So I don't know exactly what it's going to be. But again, match up the picture with the title. You can't never go wrong, okay? Go to my website, saltwaterhillstarot.com. In the extended reading video sections, You, it's not going to be difficult to figure out. Trust me but it's gonna be there, okay? So I wanna thank you for your likes, your shares, and your subscriptions here on YouTube. Follow me on Instagram, xi underscore missy underscore xi, and I am accepting reading requests again. All of the info is in the description box below. I'm also doing Reiki personal sessions for next month, January, and that is going to be $250 for about 45 minute session. It includes us pulling cards in the beginning and then doing the healing session after. Um, email me for that again. Everything is about emailing me, okay? Not for the purchase of the extensions though, but um, what else? What else? Oh, I have a Witch's Brew this Sunday as well as, um, no, Witch's Brew is on January 11th and I have an hour of power Zoom session this Sunday. <sighs> Everything's on my website, saltwaterhillstower.com. See you in the extended. Love you.